What's up, fight fans? This is Kurt Deville with Counter Punch Boxing News, and I have some new news concerning Oscar De La Hoya. Oscar De La Hoya is asking his fans on social media what do they think of the idea of a rematch between him and Felix Trinidad. The Golden Boy suffered his first loss to Tito Trinidad, which his record um, was well, is 42-3 and 35 to 21 years uh, 21 years ago on September 18th, 1999, and losing a controversial 12-round majority decision. Okay. Um, okay, the scores were 15-115-114. 115 113 for Trinidad and 114 114 even. Okay, in hindsight, it's easy to see why the judges favor Trinidad as the winner. As De La Hoya gassed out after five rounds and he looked tired and afraid in the last seven. Trinidad is one of the greatest Puerto Rican fighters in the history of the sport and, and he accomplished a lot in his career. A lot of Trinidad's loyal boxing fans might not be happy to see him return to the ring at his age. He doesn't look young, and he wouldn't have so much weight to lose. Okay. The boxing fans on Twitter are overwhelmingly against the 47-year-old Oscar De La Hoya coming out of retirement to face chubby Trinidad, who looks elderly at this stage in his life. The 47-year-old Trinidad has put on a lot of weight since he retired in 2008. Trinidad retired after losing to Roy Jones, who was a shot fighter by that point of his career. Obviously not, because <laughs> he had enough spunk in him to beat Felix Trinidad, just counterpunching this article and whoever wrote this article. But for Trinidad to come back to face De La Hoya at 154, he would need to lose a lot of weight. It wouldn't be a surprise. It wouldn't be surprising if Trinidad required to trim down 50 pounds to get to 154, and probably wouldn't be healthy. De La Hoya recently said in an interview last week with Ring TV that he was thinking of making a comeback against the top fighter from the 147-pound division. He says, "I've been working out. I've been training. I've been in staying in shape." I'm obviously not in fighting shape yet to go 12 rounds, but I'm sure that I can get there. We'll see, said De La Hoya last week in an interview with Ring TV. Now, De La Hoya wanting to fight Trinidad at this point, I think, uh, you can tell it's something that always bothered him. I thought Trinidad actually did enough to beat Trinidad in that fight. I know the last four rounds, he I think he felt that he was uh, farther along on points at that point, and he just coasted, avoided the big punches of Trinidad. Trinidad did catch him with some because he was avoiding shots because he wasn't even really fighting anymore. He just kind of was circling around and getting out of the way, okay? So I think that was the reason. But, of course, a fight to that magnitude, a unification fight between two undefeated 26-year-old welterweight champions. I think the fans and everyone expected more. That's why they weren't that hell-bent or, you know, or, or, or pissed off about the decision because of how Oscar De La Hoya was uh, fighting. He was avoiding the confrontation when he should have done like he'd done earlier that year with Obercar and I Corte. okay? He went balls to the wall with I Corte. He knocked out Obercar in a dy dynamic fashion, okay? But with Trinidad, he tried to take it easy. I wanted to show him a boxing lesson. That's what he told um, a lot of people that would listen. But to see him wanting a fight with Trinidad again, um, I've seen Trinidad lately, well, about six months ago. He looks nothing like he looks, people. I mean, he looks like the he has a dad bod. He looks like he's... He looks his age. He looks 47. You know, actually, I'm going to look up Felix um, Trinidad now. Let's see how he's looking now. Um, I mean, he doesn't look bad, you know, and, and the good thing is, like, you know, he, he do, he's not in terrible health shape, but you can tell he's definitely um, put on some weight, okay? But... Let's be real. He fought Roy Jones at, what, 168? Okay? So he was going up in weight anyway. 168 or 175. So, I mean, he was way past that. Um, yeah, he, I mean, he you could tell he, he's, he has a dad bod. 
<laughs> you know, I mean, he's been retired since 2008. That was a very long time ago. Okay. You know, um, actually 12 years ago, that's been a long time. So, you know, he's put on a lot of weight. He's living the rest of his life. And I don't think that anybody really asked him what he thinks about a rematch because, I mean, he won. He beat Oscar De La Hoya. So who says he will want to give Oscar De La Hoya a rematch? You know, I think it's it bothers De La Hoya. If, I mean, yeah, it bothers De La Hoya, if anything. That's why he's mentioning that. And I also think it's a safer bet to, to turn around and try to fight someone like Spence or Crawford or any of these guys that are in their shape that are a hell of a lot younger than him now. So I think he's reconsidered. That's why now he's like, hey, well, what do you guys think about Felix Trinidad, my, someone my age? Okay, now I get that. I can understand that. So maybe he's having second thoughts about fighting these young guys, you know. So it might be a little discernment in um, <laughs> the way he now he's starting to think, okay. But anyway, you know, Felix Trinidad versus Oscar De La Hoya, I think me counterpunching, me closing, I think that fight should have happened years ago. I mean, years ago. I mean, it should have happened maybe after the Hopkins loss. He should have fought Felix. Um, that would have been a great fight. I think it would have served better then, like 06, um, 05. You know, I think that would have been better for both guys. But now, you know, both of these guys have been out the sport. Of very, matter of fact, they retired the same year because Manny Pacquiao retired Oscar De La Hoya in 2008. Felix Trinidad retired in 2008 by Roy Jones. Okay? They got out of the sport the same year. They're the same age. Both born in 1973. I forget who's older. They're like Prince and Michael Jackson, same age. Right? But anyway, you guys tell me what you think about Oscar De La Hoya um, inquiring about a rematch with Felix Trinidad. Of course, please subscribe. And you guys have been counterpunched. Peace.